So you just learned Python and you're interested in web development. Now, of course, there are various ways you can build web apps using Python. You can build everything from scratch, but if you have to do that for every single project, that's just going to be a pain. That's why there are some programming genius that has already done this for us. Instead of building everything from scratch, you can just use a framework. So basically, the framework will have everything pre-configured for you. So all you have to do is just to set up a new project using that framework anytime you want to build a web app. Now, there is a bunch of Python frameworks out there from Flask to CherryPy to Web2Py and even FastAPI. But in this video, we'll be looking at Django, the almighty framework as I call it. Django, as you might have guessed, is a Python web framework, which means that it allows you to build web applications using Python. Now, Django is popularly known for its scalability and most importantly, its speed. You can literally build a full project in a very short period of time using Django. And this is because most of the stuff has already been done for you. All you have to do is just start building. It's very easy to start building with Django. First of all, you need to make sure that you have Django installed. Now to do that, just open up your terminal and run bit3 install Django. And that's it. Django is now installed on your computer. But also note that if you're on a Windows PC, you need to open your command prompt and run pip install Django. You don't need to add pip3 when you're running on a Windows. So once you have Django installed now, the next thing to do is just start a new project. Now to do that, just run Django admin start project my site, where my site can be the name of the project that you want to run, that you want to create basically. Now a new folder will be created in that directory where you run that particular command line. And what you just want to do is to go into that folder that has been created and then run Python 3 manage.py run server and boom you have your first django app running so if you copy the link that is being given and just paste it in your browser you're going to see that you have this django template saying that your installation works successfully now that's just the basics of django how you can get started with django build new projects of course there is a lot of things in django that you need to learn if you really want to own you to django so if you're interested in learning Django, there's a ton of tutorial online and also on my channel, so check that out. And that is Django Explained.